said, eat shit. Eat it. Eat it. Look at all these kills. Die, all of you. What's up, everybody, and welcome back to a Let's Play. My name is Tom, and this is the Battlefield 1 Open Beta on the PlayStation 4. Uh, this rolled out a few days ago, I believe. Um, I downloaded it last night. Um, thought I'd check it out in this here Let's Play. Um, Battlefield 1, it's kind of excited me from the trailers and stuff. It's interesting to see it go in a, uh, a new direction, but I guess it's an old direction when you look at it, uh, going back to World War One. Um, so yeah, without further ado, let's jump in. Now, just as a disclaimer going forward, uh, this Let's Play may not contain any gameplay because apparently the beta servers are fucked. <laughs> beta, beta, however you want to pronounce it. This game is in a pre-release stage of development. This means that some parts of the game may not function as expected or might not function at all. <laughs> <laughs> yep, you got that right. Some people apparently aren't playing the game. I read an article, or uh, well, not read an article, but um, saw the headline. Apparently it was down for like 10 hours on day one, which is bad, but like I guess that's why you do betas, right? <laughs> so just uh, come launch dates, not fucked like Battlefield 4 was. Jesus Christ, I remember buying that game, uh, playing it on PS4, and it was just broken as all hell. Uh, in the first couple of weeks, and even like months down the line, it was still like you couldn't get into servers, it was laggy, it was just a mess, absolute mess. Okay, so why don't we jump into a game, I think, I'm gonna go Rush, I used to like that mode, uh, back in, back in the Battlefield days of the Xbox 360, so... Uh, I remember I just thought uh, before we go forward, I'm going to mu mute my microphone because as enthralling as this audio commentary may be, I'm sure the members of my team don't want to hear that shit. <laughs> so yeah, as I was saying, so kind of my experience with uh, the Battlefield franchise, if you, were, uh, if you will, um, I remember back uh, on Xbox Live when I used to own a 360, uh, me and a bunch of friends of mine used to play the heck out of Battlefield Bad Company 2. So many hours were put into that game, it was unreal. I have fond memories of um, being on the one desert map, for the people that have played Bank Company 2 will remember that one desert map where the attackers uh, go down a long road to get to kind of the first uh, kind of area of conflict, I, I guess. Uh, and I remember being on the defensive side, and me and a buddy of mine uh, used to run out onto this road and just line it with mines and then run off into the distance onto like a hill and then you would just see these quad bikes and stuff run over these mines and go spiraling off into the distance or you get like jeeps and that would come over and just explode oh it was fantastic and i remember as well uh that same buddy of mine when we were attacking we we spent the whole game in like a tank and just roll steamrolled through the entire map just absolutely dominated picking up kills it was awesome uh so yeah bad company 2 I've got great memories of. I just realized I could have skipped all that. My apologies. Uh, here we go. Different classes. Assault, Medic, Support, Scout. Um, uh, squads. Do we have a... Okay, so here's my squad. Uh, we've got a, a Support, an Engineer. Uh, okay, so it looks like we could do with maybe an Assault guy. So I'm, I'm going to jump into Assault. Okay, fantastic. Straight in. Man, this is already uh, bringing back so many memories. Uh, so yeah, and then in terms of like after Battlefield Bank Company, uh, I picked up Battlefield 3. Uh, sunk, you know, a decent amount of time into that game, uh, but not nearly as much as Bank Company 2. And then come Battlefield 4 uh, on the PS4, um, it was just, yeah, I played that game for a couple of weeks or maybe a month, uh, and it was just buggy as all hell. So I thought, fuck this, um, and just and just ditched it basically. And now, kind of my, uh, in terms of the time that I spend gaming, I don't typically, uh, you know, ju uh, jump into multiplayer games that much. I am very much a, a single player guy now, with the rare exceptions being like uh, I picked up Battlefront um, last year. I think Battlefront would be now. Um, so yeah, I'm not really a multiplayer gamer anymore, but. Um, Battlefield 1 
uh, spoke to me because as I said at the beginning of the video it was kind of refreshing to see it come back into a World War I setting um, you know the first person shooter genre now is very much dominated by kind of uh, you know futuristic warfare you know the game's been set during kind of in the future Jesus Christ that's a tank oh dear oh dear oh dear holy shit can I prone I can prone bloody hell 1% live medic medic <laughs> Jesus look at this guy on horseback that is dope oh he almost ran me over the horse Jesus Christ so much stuff is going on here yo I need an engineer over here ASAP I'm pinned down <laughs> I'm going to die out here oh Jesus Objective B is destroyed. We've lost that. Okay, I, I couldn't do anything there, team. There was a big fuck-off tank. Is that a dude? Is that a dude? No, I'm shooting at a rock. I don't have anything I can use against this tank. I just have a grenade. Oh, Jesus. There's horses everywhere. I feel like... Aren't the horses, like, going to be a bit pointless on this? Because you're just going to get shot off them immediately, aren't you? Surely. I mean... I'm shooting at this horse here. I don't know if I'm actually shooting at a guy. I'd rather be shooting at the the enemy than the horse. Like I can't even tell. Is that a, a friendly? Oh, he's come out of the tank. Oh, you bugger. Where the hell is he? He got back in. He got back in. No, he isn't. He's over there. Oh, I run oh that was a bad idea. Yeah, you just waltz up behind the tank, Tom. That's a great idea. How can I change my class? Oh, here we go. So I want to be... Or maybe, was I the right class for that? Maybe I was. Because there's usually like an engineer, but I... Uh, oh, who the hell knows, right? I'm spawning back as an, as an assault. What do I have here? Retreat. Oh, I did. I had an explosive weapon. Holy crap. Yeah. Oh, fucking twat. Oh. I had some sort of sticky grenade there. And some fucking dynamite charges. Wow, Tom, way to like, way to observe your surroundings and be observant of your class. That's just, what a great start. There's a guy over there. He's probably seen me. He hasn't seen me. He's not dead. How do I grenade? That's the grenade. Oh, damn it. I got the grenade kill though. Look at that guy just waltzing up there in the tank. I have a bayon uh, bayonet charge, which is fantastic. I just realized. There's that, there's that tank again. Man, I'm so used to, like, I just want to pull out, like, an RPG or something. <laughs> and just, like, pick off this tank in the distance. But, no. No, this, that's that's not a... Uh, that wouldn't be historically accurate. Is this, ta is this this tank disposed of? No, it's not. I have this charge here. I'm going to do my best to throw. Any good? Light. There we go. Damage the tank. Ooh! Nice. He's done. Did we get rid of it? It's... Ah, oh, it's retreated. That's right. You better fucking run, you son of a bitch. Are you still there? We have lost objective okay. I haven't got any more of those. I'm going to run in with some dynamite. Ooh. Oh, dear. <laughs> I tried. I tried. Man, it completely changes up the, uh, the battlefield gameplay, though, because... Now you've got to get really up close and personal with um, kind of vehicles and stuff to do to do damage. It's really it really changes it up a bit. Jesus, that guy's done. Look at that guy over there. It's him. Oh, someone stole somebody's kill. Oh, and there's another dude. What the Christ? Oh my God, they're literally at our spawn. He's just chilling there. Look at him. Gonna pick people off as soon as they spawn. Why not, mate? Why not? I would do the same. <laughs> Rack up some cheat kills. Where is he? I've spawned in here now, and I forgot. It. I forgot where he is. Man, we're getting absolutely dominated. But in turn, man, I've got some. Man, that is awesome. Guy just screaming out as he charges forward there with with his bayonet. Here we go. There's a guy over there. How do I mark? Marking is incredibly important in battlefield. Holy mother of God! Not. Look at that guy up there in the mountains. The enemy has armed Taking the high ground. What a legend. I'm going to get killed by him. Is he still alive? I was going to say, I thought my teammate would look at him up there. How do I mark? 
I need, I need to inform my team that there's some sneaky bastard up there. Here we are. Throw grenade, zoom, fire, spot is R1. Fantastic. Thank you. Holy Jesus. Didn't spot him quick enough though, did I? Shall I try out a different class? I'm going to try the support class. Uh, in terms of kind of like the visual fidelity though of the game, rather impressive. I mean, Battlefield games have always been uh, impressive uh, visually when running on the uh, DICE engine. And, uh, not the DICE engine, sorry. Uh, the Frostbite engine. Uh, but this certainly seems like a step up. Nice environments. Um, every, uh, you know, DICE always nail kind of sound. They're very good at um, kind of capturing the sound of, that, of, uh, of warfare and things. Um, it seems to be definitely the case in this. Uh, it certainly was in uh, Battlefront as well. You can throw ammo pouches with R. Whoa! What the hell was. Bloody tank again. Right, there's a tank, excuse me, pretty much near our spawn. So we need to do something about that ASAP. Back to the assault. Where the hell is he? There he is. Have that, you son of a gun. I disabled it at least. Got killed by some guy, but I disabled the tank. I'll take it. That's the the beauty of kind of Battlefield games, is that you do you uh, get rewarded a lot for helping out your team, and uh, you know damaging uh, vehicles there like that, and kind of spotting people, you know capturing the objectives and stuff. Uh, whereas a game like Call of Duty, um, it's just very much about you know getting the kills. It's all about that KD in it. All about that KD. Okay, so we seem to be failing to defend our objectives effectively here. We are getting absolutely overrun. I'm, I'm going to get onto this maxi, whatever this is called. I might have just butchered the name of that. Where are they? That's fantastic. Just a flaming wreckage here, obscuring my damn view. Uh, anybody over here? No. I'm not seeing anybody. Objective B destroyed. Fantastic. Now we have to fall back. Return to the, combat area. Return to the battlefield. Oh, shit. Get in here. Oh, this might be... Can I... I'm trying to break down this window, but it's not happening. Right, I'm going to... Uh... What the hell have I just pulled out there? Never mind. <laughs> oh! Wow, these objectives are... Uh, close to the previous ones. Grenade. Run. Enemy hit. Jesus, I'm hearing screams. People are getting shot. There's bloodshed. So on edge. Oh, thank God. I thought that was uh, an enemy tank then, but it's ours for once. Holy sugar bunnies. He's down. Man, firing from the hip. That's what it's all about. Yeah, dude, you just take down that wall. Why not? This is your battlefield, my friend. The enemy has armed objective apples. How? They have slipped through high defenses. I just saw a dude there pop up. Yeah, I knew it. Ah, oh, shit, I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. How am I on fire? <laughs> what is going on? Right, I'm going to try and disarm this objective. Hold in there, objective A. I'm coming. Oh, Jesus. Oh, it's taken. It's taken. It's taken. Fuck it. I may have just give away my position. Trying to shoot that guy on the balcony. Is he still there? He's not still there. He is still there! Take that. And there's some other dude still in there, I think. So we're going to go and clear out this uh, this little hidey hole of theirs. And just open the door. <laughs> so they're gunning it down. <laughs> Did we get everybody in here? Yeah, they're all done. We have defused We have defu What the cr Wow, it turns out, no, I did not, I did not clear that, uh, that freaking, uh, room there. Jesus Christ, where the hell did he come from? Right, we're gonna try medic. Oh, it seems to have uh, some sort of rifle here now. Is it semi-automatic? Yeah, it is, okay. Cool, still got a uh, bayonet, which is pretty dope. They're all still definitely in this house, aren't they? I probably haven't pe picked the, uh, best weapon here now to, uh, to clear this, this, uh, this room. Ah, they're up top, I think. Are they up top? No, I'm just climbing to the roof. Where the hell are they? Here we go. No. Great accuracy here, Tom. Smashing. Oh, 
come on. Yo, that was my kill to begin with. I haven't stole that. Whoa, hello. Watch out, dude. Damn it, defeat. Defeat. <sighs> Man, we got absolutely uh, obliterated there. I guess, should we jump into a next round here? Oh, this, I'm getting in this, if I can. Dude, wait up. Dude. No, he's not. He's not. He's not letting me in. Must be a uh, one-person vehicle, maybe. I don't know. Man, it seems to be um, the, the kind of maps are, I don't want to say smaller, but like the objective placement seems to be a lot a lot closer, if that makes sense. Maybe it's, maybe this was the case for Rush or like in the previous Battlefield games, but I want to say, like in terms of the, what the crap? I want to say in terms of uh, being the attackers, you're certainly getting to the objectives a lot more quicker. Oh no, sorry. It's because we're defending. That'll be why. There's me thinking we're attacking, but we're actually defending. Way to play close attention to the game there. Tom, right, I'm jumping into this tank. Thank you very much. Get into this bad boy. How do I... It doesn't tell you any button prompts, how to accelerate or anything. This is just it now. Oh, tank on tank. How do I... Have I got any, like, main cannons or something? How do I fire those? Switch. It's telling me like to switch weapon, but how? <laughs> how do you want me to do that? I can self-repair the tank, which is pretty cool. I think that's what it's doing. Do I have to switch placement or something? I must do. Man, this is like this is enthralling. I must. Uh, I must have to like manually switch to the different weapons by the looks of it. I mean, this is World War One after all, so what do I bloody expect? All right, switch. Other side. Thank you. Fire. He's done. <laughs> okay. We're rolling out. I see some dudes. Hello. Goodbye. I'm stuck. Okay, the tank is legit stuff. Fantastic. No, we're rolling out. Dude on horseback. I'm going to chase him down in a tank. Why the hell not? Die. 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 That's one freaking powerful horse taking all those rounds to the ass. Oh, dear. Hi, my friend. How we doing? I'm dead, apparently. That's me done. Wow, one shot, one kill. Okay, I'm just gonna, like, camp at A. Make sure it's well defended. <gasps> but it's so tempting to jump on the horse. I'm doing it! Man, look at this. Wow, what, what badass? I'm going in. I have, like, some sort of freaking musket. Or something. Man, I want him to like wheel just like whip out his, his pistol. 82 damage. Come on, he's gotta be dead. Eat that. Man, I take it back. The horses. I mean, I may have spoke too soon. Yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> I was gonna be like, man, riding on horseback is sick. It's totally not. Man, has someone just like full on parked? Someone has like parked the tank right on top of the objective, I think. Unless this is. No, yep. Yeah. Someone's parked an artillery truck just right on the objective in the hope that they won't be able to arm the bloody thing. But I think that's not how the game works. Holy crap, there's a sniper there in the distance. He's who shot me. Die. Thank you. Run away from that sniper. I saw the glare in the distance. I'm camping out there. Whoa! Ragdoll. <laughs> God damn it, these tanks, man. Should we change a class to show off another one? I think I should. Uh, we'll try the scout, I guess. I never usually play scout in a battlefield game, or I never did. I just, I much rather uh, would be up close and personal. There's another tank there. Fantastic. So once again. I have chosen the wrong class at the wrong time. Holy mother of God. Eat grenade. Holy crap, that's a tank. I'm useless here. Yep. Okay, I thought I'd maybe be able to take cover behind a wall. But then I realized it was battlefield. And walls can be destructible and are destructible in this game. Yeah, screw the scout. It's assault all day long. To deal with these freaking tanks. Oh, heads up. See ya, dude. Oh, come on. He's like, I don't know where I'm being shot from. I'm just going to duck. 
Hope for the best. I saw some guy like manage to sprint to A. I wanna. I hope uh, the team managed to kill him. I think he's dead. Oh, heads up! That's a sniper. Holy crap! Get down. And there seems to be a tank coming over on the horizon as well, which is fantastic. Hello? Are you still there, Mr. Sniper? Guy on horseback, though. No, he's done. Okay, so I've got a good feeling about holding down the uh, certainly objective A, because there's a lot of open space that they have to run into to get to it. And there's a tank coming over there, so easy as he does it. Stay hidden. Whip out your freaking hench grenade. Okay, he's not moving. He's just sitting there. I'm going to try my best to try and get to him, but then at the same time... Okay, so we seem to have a few guys back here defending the objective, which is cool. I'm now going to try and run to that tank and do my best to remain hidden. Ouch. I think he's seen me. Grenade! No, I haven't been spotted by the tank. But a marksman there in the distance. What a bugger. There's another tank over there. I'm not going to be able to reach it with my explosives. I'm going to have to get in. What the bloody hell? Take it easy, my friend. Jesus Christ. Nowhere is safe on this map. Look at him just having a right good old time there. What the? Are you being serious? Come on. Really? You can't just sit there at a guy's spawn. That ain't right, dude. That ain't right. Play it fair. Look at them, like ants. Just all over our spawn, everywhere. Here we go, look at him. Eat shit, you son of a bitch. Another guy over there. Ah, oh, come on. He's done. There he is, I see you. Ah, oh, come on. 23 health left, for God's sake. Whoa, he's done. Get out of there, dude. Oh, Jesus. Unlucky, son. They've have jammed. They've armed the objective. They've armed the objective. Disarm it. I have you covered. I think. No, I don't. Sorry. <laughs> oh, come on. What can we do there? There's a tank just chilled there. We're not, we're not getting close to that at all. At all. That's done. Just give up. Holy moly. Sector last year, I thought so. Damn it. Run away. Right, so this is where we started the previous game, I believe. Holy mother of God. Is that it? Is he done? Is he done? Is that tank done? Just to be safe. I think he's done. Can I cancel this throw? I can. Woo! Oh, they're arm B, of course they have. There's me thinking, yeah, alright, guys, I've got it secure. Jesus, alright. Tom Cruise. Mission Impossible into that bloody objective there. Oh, for God's sake, man, these tanks. 70% of my deaths during these few games have been from the bloody vehicles. And I'm the guy that's meant to be uh, dealing with them. Oh, for God's sake, return to the combat zone. So we've lost those two objectives. Fantastic. Best thing I can do now is kind of like maybe chill here and just wait for them all to come around here. Pick as many off as I can before I die. Yeah, dude. Deadly sin. Get up there, man. You're the first line of defense. They've armed Objective B. How? Oh, look at this guy. Yeah, improve your accuracy, mate. Jesus. If he kills me now, I... Dude! I had it under control. I was going to say, I put an entire clip of this bloody machine gun into him, and he's not going down. How have they got to Objective B? Understand? We have to My good. Whoa, dude, 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 dude. You're on fire, mate. You're on fire. Just as a note to self, you're probably aware of that, but just to let you know you're on fire. Man. He's done. He gone. He gone. Man. Fucking sniper over there again. I, I knew he was going to kill me. I knew he was. Run. Jump. Duck, do anything to try and avoid this sniper. Please don't kill me. I beg of you, show mercy. All I want to do is disarm this objective. Please. Please. Why? I'm... I was going to say it. I saw two teammates come out of this building then. Why have you not disarmed the objective, but it's freaking outside? I was going to say, what are you doing, man? 
What are you doing? We have defused there we go, sorted. Disarmed. How many? They've got 58 tickets left by the looks of it. I think we can do this. Enemy coordinates have been sent to artillery, okay. That can only be good. Come on, guys, we have this. Come on, guys. We got this. Only 58 more people to kill. That's doable, right? And cut to the part where we lose the game. <laughs> Cheers, dude. He's down. There's another guy over there. I'm pressing R1 to spot him, but it's not having it. There's another guy over there. I don't know if you guys see him. He should do now, because he's got a big red thing over his head. Ouch. I knew I couldn't stay there very long. Come on. How are you not done? How are you not asleep? Oh, it's a grenade. Please don't kill me. Thank you. Oh, is that a dude? It's oh, my God. Yes. Oh, come on. Where did you come from? Just a horse chilling here. Don't mind me. You guys have fun killing one another and shit. I'm just going to stay here. Not run to safety or anything. Just realized that was a bad idea. Just to stand there like an absolute gorm while the sniper's in the distance. Where the hell is that sniper, dude? It's going to make all the difference. <laughs> This is where I could really do with that. Look, he's up there. Every time I see that bloody glistening thing, I get scared shitless. Someone just thought, screw you. <laughs> the tank's opening fire. Take him down, deadly sin. Take him down. Rain fire upon him. I have my sweet ass gas mask. Let's just run around in that for no particular reason. Seems to be no one holding down this place anymore. Knew it. Look at him trying to go prone and stuff. Not today. Whoa! Grenade going out. I'm gonna jump on this turret. Ah, oh, there's a tank coming down this way. Whoa, look at him! Hi, my friend! Go to sleep. Yes! Yes! Keep coming this way, people. Keep coming this way. This area is totally safe. There is not a guy on a turret just waiting for you. Eat shit. Eat it. Eat it. Look at all these kills. Die, all of you. Guy on horseback thinking he's going to ride on through. Not today. Eat bats. Whoa, you see that guy's backpack? <gasps> 12 dudes left, I think, now. Although I feel like I've just killed 12 guys right there. Right, we seem to have a few guys back there now. They've picked, clocked on to the fact that that's where they're coming from. Yes! Victory screams! Look at that! We won as the defense. There we go. Fantastic. Alright guys, so that was a look at the Battlefield 1 open beta on the PlayStation 4. Uh, thank you guys for checking out the Let's Play. Uh, in terms of my kind of initial impressions on Battlefield 1, I enjoyed it. Um, I think it's pretty cool. I like the, the World War 1 setting and how that changes up the gameplay um, in terms of you know, the more obvious things like the weapons and the maps and things and the vehicles. But, you know, they seem to have um, certainly made rush mode a bit more tighter. Uh, the objectives seem to be a lot more uh, closer together. Uh, so it makes the gameplay a bit more fast paced. You're getting into combat a lot quicker. Um, and yeah, the, the World War One setting changes up the gameplay nicely. Uh, you know, in terms of the being an engineer to dispose of the vehicles, you now have to get a lot more up close and personal with the kind of... Uh, dynamite and the explosives and things uh, it takes it takes a bit of time to kind of adjust to the weapons and and get to know them and things and reacquaint yourself with the classes and how they work and stuff uh, the game looks great and from a visual standpoint it's very impressive um, will I pick it up probably not <laughs> like I said uh, in the early earlier in the let's play I'm not very much of a multiplayer guy anymore um, if anything I'd be only buying this game for the campaign uh, I haven't played a World War one or a World War, sh uh, sh I should say, World War shooter in quite some time. Uh, I think the last one I played was probably World at War, uh, which, even thinking about it, brings back a lot of uh, fond memories. So I think that would be the only reason I'd be picking it up for the campaign. Um, uh, but yeah, uh, so I, I kind of liked it. Um, let me know in the comments what you guys think about Battlefield 1. Are you going to pick it up day one? Have you played the open beta? Uh, give us your thoughts. And as always, if you liked the video, then please like, share, and subscribe. And until the next one, folks, take it easy.